Welcome everyone, I would like to show you how to log Snapchat on your iPhone. So I open it up and oh wait, nope, you have to use your Face ID or passcode or Touch ID in order to regain access to the app, okay? So this will happen every single time you go into the app, every single time, okay? So in order to get this started, uh, we're going to open up, oh my goodness, we're going to open up here uh, the clock app. So you want to open up the clock app, yes, the clock app, and we're going to do a little trick with the timer. So just tap on timer and you see it when timer ends tap on this one you may have a ringtone set just go all the way down and you're going to tap on stop playing then you're going to find at the very top here set so from here we're now going to open up the shortcuts app if you don't have the shortcuts app uh, download it it's completely free from the app store now once the shortcuts app is opened we're going to tap on automation if you don't see automation you will need to upgrade your iPhone to the latest iOS version and then from here I already have an automation so I'll delete mine so we start fresh so you're gonna see here create personal automation tap on this one you're gonna scroll all the way down until you see app just tap on app and then you see the choose tap on choose and here's where you select snapchat you can also select multiple apps at once, okay? So if you want to lock multiple apps, maybe you have some hidden photos, you could lock the Photos app and you'll be good to go. So I'll tap on Done, Next, and then we need to add an action. So the action we're going to add is Timer. So you're going to search for Timer, and you see Start Timer, tap on this one. And we want to start a timer for one, okay? So just type in one, and then not minutes, we're going to do second. So once the timer ends, it's going to lock your iPhone. It's very simple. So we'll tap on next and we'll turn off ask before running. We'll tap on don't ask and make sure notify when the run is off. And once we tap on done, now when you open up Snapchat, it's going to wait one second. The timer is going to end and your device is going to lock. How cool is that? So if you ever want to turn this off in the future, you just go to the uh, personal automation area. Uh, the reason why I get that double lock, by the way, is because I'm on the beta iOS. You see that beta message, okay? So let's go to shortcuts. And you can just either uh, disable the automation by tapping on that toggle or slide and tap on delete. So with that being said, thanks for watching. See you guys later. Bye-bye.